right, so I guess we're counting. Okay, cool. So, all right, good morning. All right, this is Rob Nelson. All right, this is, uh, uh, I'm out in the garden, out in the yard this morning, so I hope you guys are doing great. Um, just want to get uh, get right into it today. This is uh, day five of the uh, 21 days of transformation, okay? So the day five, uh, I'm going to go through the uh, a reminder and, uh, and kind of talk a little bit about the uh, some of the exercises and some of the things that you might be experiencing because uh, I'm experiencing them today. Okay, so um, all right, so we'll talk about fiber system first. All right, so in the in the 21 day pack, or not 21 day pack, but in the uh, cleanse pack that you bought, or that if you haven't bought that you should, uh, your uh, your first 10 days you're going through a uh, fiber system uh, cleanse. All right, with super detox. And you're taking that three times a day. All right, so, all right. If you want this thing to be really effective, though, you have got to drink water, and and not just a little bit of water. You got to, you got to drink more water than what you really probably feel comfortable doing. Um, and the reason being, uh, if you if you're going to get the best effect out of this, uh, you got to get rid of the toxins that are in your body. Your uh, your small intestines are responsible for uh, picking up the nutrients. Uh, they've got uh, like little fingers inside your intestines that absorb absorb the nutrients and put them into your blood so that the cells can use them okay all right so when you've got too much crap and no other way to say it you got too much crap inside your intestines those things aren't functioning the way they should be all right so you have got to get uh, your body cleansed in order to absorb the nutrients and this is going to do a couple of things one you're going to improve uh, your overall energy because when you start absorbing uh, more nutrients you're gonna feel feel more power, okay? The other thing is, uh, it's gonna improve your your overall uh, probiotic health uh, because when you get the toxins out of there, the probiotics actually start living in a better environment. Um, so it seems odd that you would uh, you're worried about your your bacteria, but you need to be worried about your bacteria because it has a lot to do with your metabolism, have you, how you absorb your immune system, everything. It has everything to do with whether you're feeling good or not and whether you stay healthy or not. It's your gut health, okay? It's your gut health, okay? So I'm out here today, okay, so that's enough about the cleanse. Take it, take the fiber system three times a day, 30 minutes before every meal, tons of water, okay? Bunches of water. Uh, women, 90 to 120 ounces a day, okay? Guys, 120 to 150 ounces of water a day, depending on your weight uh, and your height. Okay. All right. So, all right. So, exercise, pain. All right. Let's talk a little bit about it. I'm sorry you look kind of rough today, but I'm out here working. All right. Because I'm out here working with a shovel. Okay. I got the tractor here, and uh, I've been prepping some stuff for uh, for garden stuff. Um, my back hurts. Okay. So I've done some things recently that uh, the exercises and stuff that are pushing my body. All right, so what happens when you have pain? Why is that? Okay, you have pain uh, because you're using muscles you haven't used. Now, I haven't used a shovel and a wheelbarrow and, uh, and done lifting and stuff like this in a long time. So when your body starts telling you these things, hey, it's hurting, you need to do what you can to not continue to inflame those muscles. So what does that mean? Every time you do something new, you need to rest a day and go to another part of the body. All right, so if you're working on your abs and the next day you're really sore, okay? Should you push into that soreness and really stress yourself? Absolutely not. You should work on your legs. You should work on your arms, okay? You should you should maybe do a a cardio routine or something that doesn't hurt your doesn't hurt your abs and your back. You do not want to aggravate those things, okay? It is a great idea to stretch yourself stretch yourself um, and I mean that that's that's so critical you're having pain don't sit around you need to get up you need to stretch you need to move do not sit still okay do not sit still work a different part of the body All right, and if you're not sure about what you should be doing uh, about exercise what kinds of exercise where you're going to get the most intensity at where you're going to get the most burn at, you need to reach back out to me. I'll give you some more tips about what the best exercises are for burning uh, fat. Okay, so that's five minutes. 
Hope you have a fantastic day. All right. And um, all right. Take care. Love you. All right. And uh, see you soon. Bye-bye.